All righty then, we're back once more for another operation on Wednesday night. I see Lord in chat there. Hello, bud. And we are here for Operation Eagle Peak. I am Killer Man Time, and I'll be your commentator slash video man for the night. And let's move on into it and get ourselves in so we can listen to the commands go over their weird stuff. So, speaking of commands, uh, for tonight, we have two teams, the Russian and the U.S. For the Russian side, we have Oddball, with his two IC being DJ, and three other SLs being a Duke and Phoenix and JKR. For the U.S. side, we have Command being Bows, two IC being Hanu, and three other SLs being Londarts, Army, and Matt. Uh, going on over to the first team for loadouts, it's going to be the Russian side, and I gotta get to... Russian loadouts. Okay. Now, some things I might read may not match up with the doc. There were some modifications made right before the operation got going. Uh, Russian loadouts infantry is going to be squad 1 SL, 2 FTLs, 2 ARs, 1 medic. Infantry option platoon armory is going to be 4 RPG 7s, 4 hats, 4 ammo bearers, 4 medics, and crewmen as needed for the mech option. There's going to be platoon armory, crewmen as needed only. Uh, vehicles consist of one BTR-80, one to three trans trucks as needed. Uh, infantry option if chosen gives a one to three trans trucks as needed. And mech option provides the additional two BTR-80s and one to two trans trucks as needed. Fob logistics, none. Support also consists for infantry options of four artillery smoke barrages, two 8mm or 81mm, wow, 8mm, that would be small, 81mm mortar barrage of six rounds, and your mech option has nothing. That is pretty much it for the Russian side. We'll be now taking a look at the US, who are a little bit simpler. Like that's ever obvious. Uh, infantry, we've got squad is going to be one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one medic. Platoon armory is going to be six lats, AT4s, two hats, and four engineers. Uh, vehicles consist of four logistical trucks with 500 ammo and 2.5 thousand build each. Uh, and we've got one trans truck if needed for moving people around. Uh, FOB and Logistics, we got Eagle Peak COP, uh, it's going to be one tow and various defensive structures. Support, none. With that out of the way, that is going to be pretty much it for the loadouts for either team, and I'll bring you in so we can listen to the funny stuff with the, the Russian side we will be tagging along with, since they have initiative for tonight. Hi right, guys, welcome to Operation Eagle's Peak, this is... Okay, yeah, I see that. Um, so it should be a good one on this nice new updated uh, e uh, EHO. So, uh, playing as the Russians round one, and then the US round two. Uh, and we're on the attack. What we're gonna do is DJ squad, the uh, squad two is gonna move out with the BTR-80 down the main road east, and uh, get to his move marker. Uh, and his intention is to be a distraction, okay? The enemy is sat at the top marker. Okay, and um, they're going to be looking at him, okay, and they're going to be shooting at him and things like that. So he's got a lot of, uh, to handle, um, but that BTR should help him. Whilst that's happening, we're moving to the uh, west with the trucks with JKR and Phoenix, and we're going to get to East Novo um, to make a western attack onto Eagle's Peak, okay? Um, I've got a mortar available that I'm going to use to help support you and we're just going to side swipe the objective, okay? Um, once you reach Q1673, you need to be looking for a radio in the tents and you need to secure it, yeah? So try and f kill off all the enemies around it and then start to dig it down, okay? Um, don't try and dig it down if you know there's enemies nearby, because you'll just get killed. Um, apart from that, uh, there's, uh, other than the fact that don't expect them all to be around that fob location either. They're going to be spread out, yeah? So look for picket um, little OPs on the flanks and out in the bushes, yeah? Don't be complacent when you approach. Uh, and that's it, yeah. Uh, any questions? 
Are we moving in waves or all together? Um, so Phoenix and JKR on the west will move in together, and DJ squad is gonna try and maneuver on their own accord, either via flanking on the east, or they're gonna get back in the BTR of, and they're gonna rejoin the west and attack at some point. Yeah. Good question. Any others? Okay, sounds good. Uh, have a good one, guys. And finally, yeah, we're live with round one. Pronounce the second T or not from there. Alex, did you pronounce the first T or not? Probably. Ah, I got no bets. <laughs> freaking Russian side has freaking hats. There are no bets. Next west road to go by the big ass MSR west road. Next west road. Alright, let's go. Yet. Was that bus running? <laughs> <laughs> That was impressive, whoever's driving your truck. Yeah, he knows that would have. Also, admin Nick, uh, I got a guy that The Russian point team point, so gonna, has the option to uh, have point, once we get to our point. hats. Okay, that's fine. Against an opposition that doesn't even have armor. I think we forgot to do, guys. Just tell your rifleman. We're already in the thick of it now, so just tell your rifleman not to use their ammo bag, okay? I'm sure everybody can follow that rule. Yeah, we they're gonna put him down and spawn before you train. If you have any riflemen in their squad and they have the chance to put it down before we get into contact, then do it. But if we're in contact, just you know, focus on that. Some weird loading hiccups there. Whoop. Oh, oh no. Jesus ah. Christ. Oh my Maybe, god. Uh, the elf number the oh no. <laughs> hey, are we actually going to the booth mark or are we gonna stop? We are one click out. We're not going to the booth mark. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there it is. <laughs> The crash that happens every up. JK, you, you know, see the ditch on the east side of the road uh, that we're approaching? It's like a very faint ditch. You got a keypad for me? I think I see it. Uh, like M17, 78, is that what you're talking about? L1695. Yeah, yeah, just copy. go down to there and then dismount the truck. Copy. Dismount, dismount, dismount. Alright, it's basic guys. Cops are covered. Let's cover keep southeast, going, guys. Keep going. Don't, don't stop at these guys. Hey, squad leader. Put basket of puppies in Charlie Fire 2. Pink, just leave the guy with me and quick out of water down. <laughs> We're going to be stopping here in about 50 meters, so just pull over over here somewhere. Turn the engine off. Oh Turn man, yeah, the 50. I need one right. on the rally. Bravo with me. Bravo north. Yep. Drop your ammo bags if you're a rifleman and not an FTL. Okay, so we're two still to get into position. So three, one, just slow and steady. Get eyes out east and see what you can see. Well, while they're getting still in position and moving, let's go and check out the hill.
Looks like the U.S. side has moved some of their forces out front as a uh, deterrent slash buffer. I wonder if the model calculator still works. Usually we play this on a night map, but uh, seeing as the update just happened, this is going to be a daytime. Two, about to be set. Stand by. Yeah, I understood to just keep your space in here and uh, let that BTR do the work for you. Uh, I wouldn't say long distance kills, but uh, it's definitely more at arm's distance than uh, usual for this operation. Lots of bushes and lots of uh, areas to move without being seen. Unless you see targets, guys, that you can engage. Should we wait a second until Squad 3 gets up on the hill before we, and then we just like regroup them? It's more like Someone like that? Yeah, we are. Or, like, do our. Do we want to like go north to the red mark, or south to the red mark, or just in between it all? Hey, get set. Yeah, yeah. We're just set. gonna be looking uh, south coast. I'm looking at uh, like north, east, east. Yeah, check out the BTR. Okay, so just uh. Just so you know, it's only smoke I can use with this mortar. Um, we can smoke out enemy positions, and also smoke approaches to enemy positions. Hold here, quick. He has probably been spotted. I would be remiss if the uh, U.S. side had not seen that move across the open field. If I'm not wrong, that is Raf right there staring right over here. So he has probably already spotted the uh, BTR. So they know there's an element over here, they just don't know how many. Into. Let's see if they've got any uh, hey, we're pretty much set. gear uh, for taking out tanks on this side or armored vehicles. Nothing of that nature, we might sweep around east. Reg, I want you to make best effort to glass the ridge lines and uh, make sure you can't spot that tow or any other positions. Does okay. not look like it. Squad 3, do you have eyes on the uh, Omega 15 6 4 hill? Stand by. That's for Squad 3, Phoenix. Command 3, be advised, I have contact. Where, uh, where is he? 
about 300 meters out. Enemy uh, tree in the tree line. Repeat, there, last for me, please. Cover now, trying to scope I believe you're calling right out that grid location. Free to engage, I will right, smoke them right. out. Just for spacing. <laughs> yeah, I'll give me Copy that. that. I'll try to pass more accurate grids as well. Just like the tree line, you'll see movement out. Yeah, I don't see them. Command updates on contacts. Uh, grids to follow. Oscar fifteen six nine. Oscar fifteen nine three. Got you. I've got that pre-dialed with smoke. You're free to engage, and I'll engage. Copy. I think my uh, Charlie squad has eyes on O sixteen nine two. Contacts. Roger. And here comes some smoke. Shot for mortars. Command, this is to. We have eyes on enemy contact and multiple defenses on Quebec 1592. Start to engage them with the uh, BTR. Good copy. Definitely got them to push back. Not quite the right thing, but it was definitely smoking them out. At least some, uh... I think those hit trees. I think they did. Yeah, they did. They hit the tree. That's interesting. I've never seen that one before. Looks like the uh, forward US LMA is going to pull back to whatever their secondary staging point is. Got more inbound, more smoke. Wider spread on it. I have no idea what these guys are shooting at. Those are good hits. My guys are calling out good hits with those mortars. Roger, that will not kill them. That will just Eight blind them. It's only smoke. Cool. Guido with me. Use. I think it's about to pop left. up. I wonder. You're on top. Yeah. Shift to the left, Benny. Spread out, guys. Name spread tags. out. 15 meter spread. I got no contacts for the southeast. Copy that. Okay, they might have moved. Command is to hmm. disregard last on location. It's going to be Close Quebec 16 I wonder if they fixed stencils. I'm seeing it on a lot of people. Quebec 16 Got you. Except for a Dukin. Dukin weirdo. I'll see if I can hit them with smoke. Hold the lean. This is disgusting. range DJ continue to suppress with BTR and infantry and um, repeat back the effect of that in a minute copy it copy stand by BTR is new eyes trying to get them lined up try it and look for heavy repositions before you move it on. Ah, I see him now. Hold, 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 hold. Ooh, someone got a really good hat in there. Just took out four people. And I don't think that was a hat. I think that was a lat shot. Who was that? That was, oh man, that was a beautiful shot. Copy that command. I got infantry. should have been a. We might need about 90 seconds on that at least. Roger, I'll count to 30 and then I'll That was an RPG 7. Not bad. Do you need squad 1 to do something while squad 3 initiates? Do you want to get the road open ground in my east? Sorry, go ahead, Quinn. Squad 1, cover them as they move up. Cover the southern approach as well. Gabby. We'll do bounding squads, okay? 
the abandoned squads. That definitely got them to abandon that side of the hill, though. Welcome to squad. It's somewhere between uh, Call of Duty or Battlefield and um, Arma. Ooh. And they did add in a small audio thing Effective for Effective pretty much everything. That's the... Uh, the smokes are landing just behind the ridge. They're landing more Oscar 1566. Um, but I, I think I can get these guys moving regardless. Command, we got guys to our uh, southeast right now. 01633. Suppress them, squad one. Help squad three move. Copy. I don't think they'll see squad three, but my guys are setting up on them right now. Sounds good. Oh, that's not good. No, say, BTR DJ, might get away around, alive. And then it'll be Phoenix, then it'll be JKR, okay? Yeah, looks like the BTR might get alive with it, or get away with its life. It's Polish Herb did advised. not get up in uh, position got, uh, fast enough. So they've spotted the uh, forward element right there. BTR is repositioned onto the hill over there. I'm not sure. I think that'll be out of sight of that uh, toe. We'll find out here in a few seconds. Also, if y'all notice, there's a uh, muzzle flash and then audio. Uh, that is the effects of sound lag for objects and moving much faster than the speed of sound. One three three is set. You're free to move if you want to hold our south. Copy. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that toe does not have a uh, angle on this BTR. Let's go back up here and see what's going on. Just putting out some max range mortars, or near max range. Command two. Go ahead. The driver for the BTR to DC. Roger, you need to put a rally down as soon as you can, because he can come back in. Any eyes on them smoke motors? Command 3, I have contact Papa 1513. That's contact within 100 meters of my guys, southeast. Ooh, flame age, not doing good. Oh, dang. Who just unloaded that? Freaking alpha. Alright, so that leaves uh, poor R2RS1 here. All on his own. It does not look like they noticed him. He is hiding effectively in the bush. Roger, 
uh, Phoenix, I've put some smoke Fire down on the now. Copy, update on grids, Papa 16, 8, 8. Either that or they're just God laying damn. out in the open. Oh, fuck. Yeah, he's dead, dead now? Uh huh. There was another one in the bushes just to our 154. Closer. Like a lot closer. Don't shoot. Bush man. And they are finally getting some return fire. JKR, I invite you to occupy the tree line. Papa 16 or 2, expect hey, contact you there. Back down for me? I'm gonna That's smoke it for you. Come get it. I'm Copy. Hit. Don't die. Fuck, Sorry, I need to. Clear back. Not clear, uh, not clear wait. Hold on. DJ, I can't provide Go. smoke for you. Down. You have to move in instantly. If you're gonna get uh, back, the BTR is gonna maneuver west and help. Almost got duck. No Actually, duck's not even there. There's no one there. As an abandoned position. hold here. I need you south of me as soon as possible. BTR down. Copy. We're moving Charlie up now. And it looks like that toe finally got the BTR. I missed it. Darn. Contact to their southeast right now. Understood one trying to support that. Copy. We're pushing over the ridge line now. Keep giving me grids and I can blind the enemy best I can from here. This is currently the first round, Slayer guy. At some point, poor Dukin died. This, uh, what is this Western element? Yeah. Squad three of the Russian side is definitely taking some uh, casualties here and there. Waiting for squad one to make its move up on the uh, southern side. Uh, I 
can this time peek out over this ridge. We've got a lot of bullets coming in and over. That's fine. Keep being the distraction. I'll try and provide support. Looks like R2 finally got taken out by Toasty. Never mind, I'm with you, I'm with you. Looks like the eastern element's really coming up on the rear here. One's taking a lot of contact from that P16 and 69 area on that hill. Roger, I'll try and get in range with them all. southern side looking down the hill listen up three one spot this smoke i'm firing one time smoke i need to know where i'm landing copy okay round out <laughs> yeah jeez man you uh you crews not not issuing the proper uh spacing when you took that lat to the face I don't think Stand that. Up. Squad one's taking Red. contact south. Okay, I'm not even. What on earth just happened over what? Oh man. We, have, we are on the mountain now. We have eyes on three Lodgy trucks and multiple sandbags. We're gonna begin to move in. When you're discretion. Roger. Uh, I'm like Muffin smoke. and uh, right, Audacity. Man. Oh, you poor Audacity. The, the humanity being blown up at the kneecap by a grenade. Uh, McMuffin left on his own with uh, Hershey and who else is left over here? Ice cream. Begin your move, DJ. Russian forces are slowly encroaching in on the U.S. forces here. Jake, just leave a buddy team to watch the southern uh, flank. 
Yeah. We need to focus in on the point now. Oh, it's like two I see it. I see it. Phoenix, was that good smoke any good for you? There's more. I got guys moving in now. Um. Stand by. Looks like Matt Muffin has uh, taken the retreat option. Sven's crew's moving up with Alpha Guido, Raggy, and uh, Grunt. Taking out some more U.S. soldiers in the way. Ones I'm looking out for are Lagar and uh, Vapor over here. They haven't done anything. Take a heavy contact. Roger. Everybody in. Let's go. Ooh, Alpha Guido getting taken out by who was that? Was that Raf or Dawson? Can't tell. Dawson's dead. Never mind. And we've got the Russian forces from the rear coming up into the compound. So this is just going to cause him mayhem. Someone trying to use a lat. Nade and takes out Moon Wolfie, leaving Apocalypse Joe on his own. And he knows it. Looks like Lagar and Vapor are coming back down and around. Probably to help Apocalypse Joe. It sounds like fucking popcorn. What's going on? Ice cream. Made it through everything and then died on the hill. Got nades going off all around them. Oh, Joker taken out alongside Hershey. DJ Russ taken out. Apocalypse Joe holding his foot against, uh, what is this, one, two, three, four, five different Russian forces right now? Moving back over here where the main conglomerate is. We're down to just a few more U.S. soldiers. And it looks like Duck and Londarts are making some short work here. Londarts finally taken out. Looks like a chief. It's finally taken Londarts out. Beef down. So south, not looking uh, too good. Not sure what that was. Was that a lat, hat, what? I don't even know who shot that. Well, they're all gone. It's going to leave whatever came from the forward element and the rear. Sven's already in. Nade going in, blind. To be aware of the trees, though, that'll bounce. Got really close to Apex and Grunt there. Squad 2, dig in like a tick. Let them come to you now. Copy, guys. Apocalypse Joe finally taken out by... Captain Morgan. And as I said, they are now on the point. They can dig in, and it is now the U.S. forces that have to come in and wipe them out. Which is not good, because I think there's only Duck, King, Turtles, uh... Bow Chica. Bow Chica sees, uh, Toaster. Toaster ran. He's execute our dude, man. Fuck. Nate out, South Talk East. to me, Mitch. On command comms, what's Go. going on? Uh, we're just trying to take out some individuals that are still hiding around Turtles here. almost taken out by a nade. Roger, okay. Ooh, Bow checking out. Not sure by who. Lots of fire going on here. Ooh, who got... Oh, Duck and... There goes Raggy. Call me, Grunt. Other way. I got him. I got two. I got the Phoenix, I'm gonna get a bit 
Okay, that's uh pretty much. Nope. Wait, wait, wait. first match. Secure the area first. Spin down. Turtle still alive. That's an AR. One still in there. No. In the tent, probably. This is a normal rifle in the tent. Or he's just on the other side of this cover. Raggy down, turtles down, taken out by I think that was uh, Mitch the goon. Sounded like uh, it. I'm just a NATO turtle edition. took out uh, two, two with them. Not bad. Uh, let's see here, what is going on here? Uh, is that McMuffins? That is McMuffins. He is still alive, surprisingly. Copy that. Happy Glamper down by Mac. Can he get Cap? Can he get Cap? Nope, Cap gets him through the tent. Alright, that might have been last. Nope, that was not last. We still got uh, Vapor over here That's and Lagger coming north up north on the north other north flank. Chavi has called out. On the east side. Looks like Lagar has been called out by Chavi. I think we've dug it down already. Vapor has taken out Chavi. Chavi is down. It's fine. Northeast, northeast. Ooh, Jones almost got vapor. Did you get him? Fuck him. Did you get him? I don't know. It's in the, it's in the tree line east. Copy. And oh. Mitch the goon down by Lagar. Good radio, double teaming here. Defend sure the location. Where. Okay. Three copies. Three's got a two-man team holding northwest cordon of the point. One man on point. Sounds good. Could we see the U.S. come back through? Vapor's still alive. Definitely hurt, though. Morgan, he's, like, on you. He's on this truck. He's on the oh, back side of this truck. I can't see him, though. Copy. He's peeking... Grunt's getting pissed. He's got tagged by Vapor. Lagar bleed it out. Or blood out. And Vapor is down. Taken out by Oddball. And if I'm not wrong, that should have been all U.S. forces. GG for round one. Definitely interesting. We'll be back for round two shortly. All right. Well, I have finally noted some things, and I'm definitely going to have to step some of the graphic settings back because it's still a little intense on the uh, system when you're processing a stream at the same time. So if there was some choppiness during the halftime, I'm sorry about that. Um, with that out of the way, uh, we are now into round two. As we normally do, we'll go over the commands for round two. So for the Russian side, it'll be commanded by Bao, with his two IC being Hanu, his two, three other SLs being Londarts, Army, and Matt. Uh, for the US side, it's going to be commanded by Oddball, with his two IC being DJ, and his three other SLs being Adukin, Phoenix, and a Joker. Move on over to the team loadouts to do that real fast. For the Russian side, we have infantry squad levels, 1 SL, 2 FDLs, 2 ARs, 1 Medic. Infantry options are going to be Platoon Armory, 4 RPG-7s, 4 Hats, 4 Ammo Bearers, 4 Medic, and uh, Crewman as needed. Ah, scratch that. No Ammo Bearers. None. Since that is a modded thing, we are not running our normal thing because of the update. So there are no Ammo Bearers. Uh, mech option, platoon armory, is crewman as needed. Uh, vehicles, we have one BTR-80, one to three trans trucks as needed. Infantry option will be one to three trans trucks as needed. And mech option will be additional two BTR-80s, one to two trans, trans trucks as needed. Fire logistics, none. Support, they have infantry options, going to be four artillery smoke barrages and two for 81 millimeter member. Bleh, bleh, bleh. 81 millimeter mortars uh, with six rounds. And then we've got the uh, mech option, which is none. Moving on over to the US side. 
a little bit easier on me. Uh, it's going to be infantry squad levels, one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one medic. Uh, platoon army is going to be six lats with AT4s, two hats, and four engineers. Uh, vehicles is four logistical trucks with 500 ammo, 2,500 build each. And we've got a one trans truck for moving troops. Uh, let's see here. We've got the fob and logistics, which is going to be Eagle P cop. Uh, it's going to be one tow and various defensive structures. Support none. With that out of the way, I will now bring you all in. We uh, will try and find the commands for the Russian side once more. All right, guys. Welcome, welcome. All right, welcome, guys. I don't know what's happening over here with your little acrobatics. It looks great. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Uh, excellent work last round. Um, I was told it was relatively close, relatively close for attack and defend, so great work. Um, I do want to say, after all of the trying to make sure we don't have an enhanced optic, your yeah. commander lovingly chose an enhanced optic and could not use his weapon and had to pull out a pistol like a fool. Don't be a fool. Uh, make sure you don't have enhanced optics, nothing that zooms in. All right, moving forward. I'm not going to do another weapons check because you guys are all adults, I think. We're going to have Matt Honcho, squad two, is going to be going on the two mark. He's going to be positioned up on the hill in the Quebec 14 area. If you look on the map, there are two ARs. Matt Honcho is going to place you specifically in fire teams with the best sight lines. You are the distraction force. You are the draw their attention. Oh, they're coming from the northeast. This is going to be bad. That is Matt Honcho's squad's role. You're also going to have the Lodgy with you. He's going to be placing a mortar for smoke support. He's going to eventually have you repositioned to come support the main attack. Let me go ahead and transition to that. Squad 1 and Squad 3 are going to go around the west, far, far west of East Novo, trying to flank the enemy without drawing too much attention. If you look in their maps, they're going to be following the red arrows down around the south. They're going to set up there on that ridge with the BTR. Mark it now. And then the infantry, you guys are going to push in from the southeast, moving northwest. Uh, Lawn squad was familiar with this terrain, and that's how they were able to get in once they whittled down our forces. Once everyone is set, your SLs are going to tell you to push in. It is important when you're attacking uphill that you don't stop, get scared, and then don't push. If your SLs say push, push. If you're hitting resistance, call it out. But don't stop, and then everyone gets killed because no one pushed. Any questions? All right, awesome. Your SLs will hand out who's driving. They will tell you where you're driving if they're not driving themselves, and they will position you. SLs, let's go ahead and break them out. And we're live for round two. All right, let's go. Do I need to go up and around, or can I go straight through? Oh, left hand side, you can uh, go through. Left hand side, copy. Left side. Nice. We will find out. Yeah, it's a, it's a bit too 
fun fun night. It was a really good chance to have a tow there. Um, so what I like about Sierra, Sierra Agent is you can sort of like uh, be part of the controller's cover. Don't have to worry too much. Obviously, the longer the bit goes, the more likely to get schwacked from the police. But yeah, the well, idea is I, for I us to be able to suppress the infantry. Um, we'll probably reposition the big car on how to leave the once we have an idea where the tow is. Hopefully, the tow's in the north. But there's so a. Uh, stuff. You're gonna have to kill yeah. there's, there's a lot of light here, like cats and lads and they've got uh, plenty of bad. That's alright, we won't get shot. Yeah, we're we're pros. Thoroughly. Rocks. Shrubberies. Point and laugh at this man. He just hit a rock. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because you didn't pick your own ruled gun. I was, I was genuinely confused when I put it. His call out is yeah. good. His like, call out is as good as the gun. Convoy just went through West yeah. Novo, approaching the airfield. Squad 2 has radio down, order down. Squad 2 is preparing to step up. Since they add vehicle impact damage, this game's fucked. <laughs> We're so fucked. Yeah, stay out of the Don't go off an airport. Two is one. One of those two will print it as epic. Vehicle damage. No, I mean. Uh-huh. It'll do more damage to the vehicle than it will to pretty much what they were saying. I would expect that. Because that game would suck. If, if you tried to I drive through force and by the time you got out, you're dead. I would expect a DTR-80 might not be able to run over a tree, um, but like a BMP or gravity or you know, any MP would be able to make it. Yeah, or something like that. So could I take an armored technical and use it as a battering ram against a map V? You could do that right now, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, yeah, but like, to actually damage it. Probably could if they... Like, could I destroy a wheel if I perfectly place the car? Oh, I get I got that. I got that. Yeah, I'll hook a left as soon as you can. Commander Squad 2. Two minutes out. Go for two. Until your entry are set. Stay safe after the road. Kevin. Choose your own adventure, folks. On that uh, tip of the screen arrow, it's a um, trench. It should be good concealment. Kevin. Did anyone else really see that? Really far. <laughs> I want to be the one seeming like crazy, but I'm pretty sure I just saw that uh, BTR end up on its roof. So yeah, it's five of us. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I can see it from here. Like you can barely see east off that hill because there's the eastern hill right next to it that just blocks it all off with trees and just landscape. Yeah. Yeah, I go like east, due east. Okay. 
Find all squads, expect contact at any time. If they pushed off the point, they could be here. Roger. Copy. Ah, uh, you almost got the pass. What was that? <laughs> Alright, my Bravo team's in position. They can see the fortifications. You want them to just go over there? Bro, we'd be dead if we did. Alright, let's have them uh, spread out just a little bit more and then uh, open up when, as soon as they're ready and then have Charlie go and open up as well. Let's uh, do a low rate of fire, but let's make the enemy really confused. That's tell your guys their job is to confuse the enemy. So they can spread out that suppression across the entire hill. Tell you now, R2 has been spotted. Matt, go for two. Uh, go ahead and send uh, Han has been spotted. Smoke to the northwest right, R2, in a field that is Raph just got spotted. <laughs> two volleys of smoke <laughs> northwest of the point. No way. Okay, no, they didn't. I was about to say, is someone actually get a kill from this range? Good shots, good shots. Three left. Yeah. That's right. Is that where they put the toe? They put the toe on top of the freaking rock out in the middle. It's Jesus. It's a little bit more than 800. Oh, there it goes. Someone got someone. Traverse left in 190. There you go, perfect. It's going well. Awesome. Go inside one more smoke volley. Yeah, it's good, Cake. I'll be, I'm probably going to be dropping some of the uh, graphical okay, settings for future streams, but uh, definitely was worth it to hop everything up Clearing to the time, maximum. Uh, town time now. Uh, one's going to take this area and we'll be set in about a minute. Copy. Tom, be aware. Copy. Yeah, I'm glad. Be, be, yeah. If they're definitely glassing it, if anything. Got just enough of a haze, I can't make anything out on the ridge. Anybody else? I think I might see one body. Maybe. Out of a rock. I see one guy, I see one guy. There's three, two, Captain six. Morgan. Three, two, Toaster. Eight. No, three, two, two. Copy. Pushing this down, I think right, Sven's over there uh, on the wall. Let's go uh, ahead and do a little bit more wall. suppression. And then you guys can start to relocate. Copy. But in comparison to uh, round one, it does look like the U.S. forces have decided, instead of sending their forces forward, have sent them on the back ridge. That is probably because they utilized that to come up on the rear for round one, so they want to make sure that does not happen. We got another one just got shot from long distance. Poor uh, tater tot. Oh no, tater tot. <laughs> 
16-2-8, copy. Yeah, we've got, what are those? Mortars or smoke? Smoke. Got unlucky, Tater Tot. Just got unlucky. All it takes. Like it's Wait, one, one. Looks like a pace code. We're on the edge of the tree. Yeah. Three, oh, one, another two, one, one down. Dang. Do you, uh, do you, Sorry, I'm switching back. Do you want me to just start to shoot into the, into there or just hold for now? How far until. Uh, uh, is that Captain Morgan moving down hillside with toaster? No. Oh. They are. Hey, don't don't knock it. Random sprayed bullet hits your face. It doesn't matter what distance it was. That's gonna hurt. Also, it doesn't help that y'all put the freaking uh. Toe in the most Bravo exposed position. Bravo can do some suppression. One and three, are you ready to push in? And the bad part is the BTR is not even on this end of the on, of the hill, so kind of failed on that one. So did I give the co sorry? Did I give the completely wrong call out? I apologize. Strike my last entirely. Matt Honcho, start maneuvering your guys. Ash, you tater. That is true. You are nothing but a grunt, and the grunt does not make the choices yeah. and the placement of things. Alright, Hana, you ready? Yep, we're ready. Alright, one, let's start attacking. Vaughn. I mean, it's not a bad placement, attack. it's just. Not going to be all very useful this uh, round. I've seen worse. I just die. <laughs> no, Tater, you live, you live. You just chose the wrong time and place to be sticking your head out for behind cover. Charlie Element from one is pushing time now. You live to die. I'm, nah, I'm not sure how I like that one. You die to live. There you go. is now taking advantage of not being able to be shot by the toe. Oh, the irony. Frank? Uh, I didn't see anything. I saw movement right in front of you. 50 meters. Oh, another one. 315, right there. He's running straight at us. I got my gun up. Do you know an approximate range on them? Uh, no, he's it's literally within meters. pistol. Yeah, he's within sniping range. <laughs> uh, you gotta be.
Thanks. Go for command. Go for command. Driver of the BTR he disconnected. I might need to uh, swap to crew. Context to your uh, west for your Bravo team. Bravo entry. Roger. Roger, you able to suppress? Wait, one. Get eyes on it. About to get Contact some close in south. action. R2 pushing up the hill. Looks like Chief Romeo, sees him. Romeo 1641. Infantry call out. Chief takes out Han. And R2. Chief taken out by. I think that was uh, Flame Mage. Let's see that a RAF. Han Either one. Your rear security is open. Copy that. And shots fired in. Frost taken out. Not sure if that was. Who got frost? I didn't hear any shots come from the U.S. forces. That was interesting. On, uh, go. Three for command. Go for command. Got a squad sitting in Quebec 16-6. Quebec 16-6. Maybe two. Yeah, Quebec 16-6. Is that a lat or a hat no, going out? I think that was a lat. One Charlie. And oh, nice hit! Looks like it pegged the uh, BTR all the way up there. And Hashling Slash is about to get not taken out, but he is bleeding. He's got a bandage. Oh, didn't bandage fast enough. Beef is queued in on the uh, action going on here. And wailing away down the uh, trench line. So what's going on over here? Fly Mage and Raf still pestering them. Pestered them off that side of the hill, actually. That's not bad. B trying to pull back to better cover, getting shot from downhill. BTR moving up. Oh, that is not good. Take it slow, guys. Captain Morgan and Toaster still roaming around the tree line down here. Polish Herb and his crew get real close to the FOB location. Just gotta get through uh, DJ Ruff, Rusts, and a couple of others. To get there. Not bad. Being themselves really up close and personal with their positions. Lots of spacing issues I can see. It's going to take one nade to take out at least two. BTR is taking up position in the tree line here. Not bad, not too far Two forward. Ooh. Camera, go back the other direction, please. Is that, that's Zero not our friendies, right? Zero two and, one. oh, Stop. explosion Charlie, just took out coops and a couple of others. On point. They're pushing in time now. Yeah. Awesome, well done. Well done. Zero two. Uh, not sure if that was a lad or not. Okay, there's no more Hanu. We'll keep it, keep Hanu is dead. <laughs> oh, that's not good. And it looks like Cap and Toaster are taken out by... Uh, yeah, Hanu got taken out. That's where what where he was. Oh, that sucks. All right, this going over, you guys. Be careful. And it looks like Alpha Guido is following uh, Cap's path here. Uh, him and a Duke alongside Grunt. Uh, was that another? No, it was not. 
Another explosion, though. Let's see here. It looks like we got a successful push into the point. Xavi is taken out by Lagar. Viet Gnome takes out Mitch the Goon. DJ Russ in the tent. Jones also taken out. Team, pull 360. Let Charlie continue doing what they're doing. BTR is down. Roger. Happy Clamper takes out Polish Herb with a execution shot straight to the back of the head. Let's keep on of course, I don't know if that's exactly what happened, but he was really close. DJ Russ tossing out a nade. No one out in that direction. And negative on any kills. Zero minus, still alive, no one sees him. Happy Glamper. Oh. Oh. Oh, morning, you guys say move. Dentric. Dentric taken out by zero minus. Vietnam still hidden there. Not sure who's taking the fires there. I think that was Happy Glamper. And Vietnam Man, takes out Happy Glamper. DJ Russ all on his own in the corner of the tent. That is not uh, a good place to be. Uh, we are just Let's see what's going on back here no on the rear. So far. Uh, looks like King's Copy. crew is Copy. having Charlie some team. difficulties getting past the uh, rear guard. Alright, three, if you start working your way to the northwest and push the enemy back, my fire team or my squad is waiting for them to fall back. Roger, we're taking context right now. They're at least uh, 30, 50 meters from us. Copy. Direction. Uh, west of us. Zero minus. Copy. Guarding against Penny D. Coming up on yourself. Zero minus getting a little Cross bold here. Q16. Q16. And Zero Minus taken out by uh, Phoenix, are, but after he took out Penny D. Uh, uh, Waiting for orders. Uh, Copy. Uh, Alright, just take advantage of what you got. Let's uh, let's have Squad 2 and Squad 3 start to push in. Copy. He just killed uh, Zero. Squad 2, Squad 3, let's start pushing in. Squad 1, start inching your 360 towards the point. Copy. And uh, Joker, just taking out. I'm not sure who got him. Uh, looks like it may have been Raph. Uh, we're going to try and move. We're not currently engaged right now. We disengaged. Hershey, not in the best position uh, here. Command, yeah, we are, we are we're, we're ready. But rear guard has been taken awesome. out. Alright, let's start closing like they're in. trying to reposition. Three, let's move. Russian One forces have done a fantastic job of uh, injecting themselves in the middle of the uh, U.S. forces here. And there's not really a lot of U.S. forces left. They have been picked off left and right. Looks like Hershey has been spotted by Raf. Did I get him? I don't know. He stopped shooting. Hershey is limping away onto the other side of the hill. There. I'm not sure you're two IC, I'll copy. Copy. I'm now free from the truck, I'm rejoining the fight. Contact close. Copy. Northeast. Not really, no. It's all it's really okay. affected. Uh, does not look like. Oh, does look like a duke and just got taken out by Lager. Uh, the op has not been particularly affected on how it runs, um, other than not having one, ammo one, bears one, 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 and not being a nighttime op. Oh, Lager taken out by Alpha Guido. Um, muzzle uh, flashes and whatnot don't really affect much on that end. Um, if you see the muzzle flash, usually either A means you're dead, or B, it's you. Um, 
beef alpha okay, moving up. Keep, keep it moving. It's inch it in, inch it in. Vietnam is uh, definitely not going to have a good day here. We got to get Vietnam out inside behind enemy lines. He's got beef hey, to two. his uh, north, north northeast. Squad need, uh, or east northeast. Uh, Actually, Alpha Guido to I his southeast one. south. And DJ Russ to his uh, southwest west. This is not good. Yeah, we gotta push in, guys. Let's move. Vietnam just needs to find a bush and not move. The more he moves, the more audio cues he gives away, and the more they can pin down where he is. Right now, they don't know where he is, so they don't want to move. Grunt's moving in. Grunt's on the other side of the tent. Squad 3, are you able to push southwest? Uh, looks to, like uh, Ice Cream may or may not have just damaged himself a bit. Vietnam taking some shots uh, at Grunt. Last contact was, so we're trying to keep it and Grunt pace, gets him through we'll the tent. Awesome. Well, let's, let's, let's keep that slow pace moving, definitely. We, we gotta push in. Yeah, I wish there was a way we could get rid of the spectator cans, but that's built in. Guys there with Raph basically get set so we can push three in closer safely. All right, well, that is a uh, poor, poor Vietnam just uh, did not survive that uh, encounter. Being surrounded on all, them with all sides. Lots. I hit a tree. Well, I hit a tree with a tandem. That's my accomplishment. That Otherwise, I probably like scared that. the shit out of the infantry man hiding behind the tree. Awesome. All right, let's do this. My oh man's still alive. Let's go. Yep. Okay, Audacity, keep going. Don't stop. Yeah. All right. Everybody, in the sound of my voice, let's smoke out west. Smoke west. I got Mr. Three, three Man. Do you have ammo? Anyone need ammo? Anyone need ammo? Yeah. Is anyone? I need really yes. blacks could use ammo. Look for eyes. I got some. Smoke I got west. Some. I got some. Right here. Everybody, let's push. Also, I was so focused, I did not see Tater Tot's message to me. Uh, Yes, I actually have done that. Um, I've also done one where I said, I'll wake up today and woke up literally the next day. I slept through an entire day. So, uh, I know what that feels like. And looks like Flame Bane taken out. Not sure by whom. Probably uh, Fuzzly or Frost, whatever. No, plus zero T six, whatever. Uh, let's see here, Joe pushing up, Joe getting shot at, Hershey trying to cover, not working so well. Alpha Guido's gotten flame mage. Liberal, I need up. Ooh, Grunt, nah, having a good day there. Hershey taken out. Uh, not sure. I think it was a trade between him and Joe. Oh my God. That was a nade out. Joe's dead. Yes, he is. Ooh. Squad three, take your guys around. Squad two, squad three at the north. Flank the north element. If you're in the north, flank around the north. Oh, we've got a flank going on here from the U.S. forces. King's taken out. Toasty. North. Northwest. Toasty and Sven trying to do something here. Watch the right side. I'll, I'll take left. Quantum spotted Toasty. Not sure if he saw Sven. Sven taken out by Quantum. And Toasty's got little chance. So what's going on over here? It looks like Alpha Guido's been taken out by someone in this little bunch here. I'm gonna say it was Apocalypse Joe. Phoenix takes out uh, the Cheese Man. 
Cheese man not having a good day here. Let's go like I south. Liberal providing the uh, fantastic support of uh, being a medic. On that radio. On me? Is he on you? All right, looks like we got uh, Russ and Beef on point for the U.S. being pushed by literally every Russian soldier left in the game. I think that was Matt Honcho went down finally. Bow still alive. See your toasty coming up on the rear. And down goes Fuzzlier. One three guy just went down behind you. DJ Russ taken out finally. Uh, northeast of us. Yep, DJ Russ is gone. That was the only one on point. That leaves Phoenix and Toasty. We are back on the American push with just two. Can they do it? Yeah, they're flanking us from the east. Copy set up for that. Do we have eyes on that radio yet? Yeah. Do we have, do we know where the uh, radio is? Radio audio on me, I think it's in this tent. Roger. Roger. You're not Eyes on radio, I can't dig without a shovel. A1, make sure you guys know that there could be a contact northeast of them north. Yeah, if radio's directly in this build, this tent on me. Go back 16, 17. 8 one I need to re-get my uh, ammo bag. It's clear. There's nobody in there. All right, I'm going to go in. You cover. 360, 360. I'm going in. Copy. Roger. Alright, now I'm in. Alright, let's send the one guy in who's gonna shovel. The rest 360. Alright, 360 guys. Digging, digging, digging. 360, pass it down. I got another friendly coming up northeast. Me. All right, let's have him stage out. He can watch us. Radio's one quarter down. Phoenix on the move. Perfect. Ooh, that is not good. God damn it! Oh, Phoenix, taken Phoenix out by there. Apocalypse Joe. Two, uh, two dead southwest. 25 meters. That barbed wire not being a uh, fantastic thing. Toasty on the move also. Taking out uh, Vapor again. Results friendly, yeah. Radio down, radio down. Radio has been taken out. Let's, uh, let's get you out of here, it is quick. now up to Toasty. And Toasty oh, failed them. Down. Shame, shame, bad toasty. Anyways, that's, uh, waiting for the call. Yep, GG for round two of Operation Eagle Peak.